Hey, this is Sam from Sure, and in this video tutorial, we'll cover the basics of automatically discovering Sure wireless equipment in Wireless Workbench 6. Wireless Workbench has the capability of automatically discovering Sure wireless equipment that's connected to your computer via an Ethernet network. But if you've ever launched Wireless Workbench 6 before and not seen any of your devices automatically populated in the inventory, you may not be properly connecting to the network that your gear is connected to. I have a rack of equipment, Sure wireless equipment, in the 192-168 IP range right next to me connected to my computer. But you'll notice in the bottom right hand corner, Wireless Workbench thinks my network is off. This network indicator indicates that the network Workbench is looking at isn't properly configured to see my Sure networked gear. If I go to the Preferences dialog in Wireless Workbench, I need to make sure that my proper network interface is selected so that I can see my equipment. Now this list under the Network tab in the Interface tab shows all of the networks my computer can connect to. You could imagine multiple networks your computer connect to, including Wi-Fi networks, hardwired networks, and so on. The network my computer currently has selected doesn't have a valid IP address. What I'm looking for is a network interface that has an IP address in the same range as my networked wireless gear. In this case, this network interface above has an IP address in that exact same 192.168 range. By selecting that network interface and pressing Save, what you'll notice is that Wireless Workbench connects to the proper network and then automatically discovers all of the equipment in that IP range. I hope this video tutorial was helpful. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more or different types of video tutorials for Wireless Workbench 6, leave us a comment down below. Thanks.